Hi, this video is here to help you with rounding to the nearest 10. When we round a number to the nearest 10, we are rounding it to the nearest multiple of 10. Remember, a multiple is a product of a number multiplied by another whole number. All multiples of 10 have a zero in the ones column. Let's round 4,238 to the nearest 10. When we round any number, we can use a number line to help. First, we need to identify the previous and next multiples of 10 and place them on the number line. 4,238 is between 4,230 and 4,240. 4,230 is the previous multiple of 10. 4,240 is the next multiple of 10. Then we place 4,238 in the correct place on the number line. We can see that 4,238 is closest to 4,240. Therefore, 4,238 is 4,240 when rounded to the nearest 10. But what happens if the number is exactly in the middle of the number line? Let's round 8,325 to the nearest 10, using the number line and sentence stems to help us. 8,325 is between 8,320 and 8,330. 8,320 is the previous multiple of 10. 8,330 is the next multiple of 10. When we place 8,325 on the number line, we can see that it is exactly at the midpoint between the multiples. It is not closer to either of them. When this is the case, we always round to the next multiple of 10. 8,325 is 8,330 when rounded to the nearest 10. Now it's your turn. Round 2,873 to the nearest 10. Use the number line and the stem sentences to help. Pause here until you're ready to check your answer. 2,873 is 2,870 to the nearest 10. Now it's time for a challenge. Which of these numbers round to 1,740 when rounded to the nearest 10? Pause here and have a go. I hope this has helped you to understand rounding to the nearest 10. Don't forget we have lots more of these maths videos on the Twinkle website if you're looking for more help. See you soon!